Hey YouTube, this is Mrs. Jackson. Um, I know it's been a few weeks since I made an update, but uh, my last video I told you that I was going to start making uh, weight loss journey updates. And um, so I finally feel comfortable um, sharing my weight loss journey with you guys. Um, I'm on Weight Watchers right now. And, um, as, well, actually, I'm not an official member, but... I'm following the plan and so far I've lost 32 pounds um, so that is some very good news I didn't think I could lose that much weight um, I started like I said in the previous video I started January 17th and um, as of yesterday I weighed myself and uh, it said 225 so that's 32 pounds lost didn't think I could do it so um, I'm just gonna share with you a little short story about my struggles with weight and everything um, and then afterwards I'll show you some pictures of you know how I used to look and how I look now and before and after pictures so let me make it quick <laughs> um, okay let's start off with when I was younger uh, my weight was never really an issue during my younger days um, but when I hit my 20s is when it got a little rough um, especially after high school. Um, I'm a real sociable person, uh, so if there was an event, if there was a family gathering, a reunion, a house party or wherever, <laughs> you know there was food and so, you know, you know I had to eat the food. Um, and a drink. I started to feel comfortable with myself also. And so my priorities started to shift and um, I stopped, you know, dieting and exercising and I was focusing more on graduating college and planning a wedding and um, I was always eating fast food because I was just too tired to cook at the end of the day of studying and planning for a wedding at the same time it was it was just rough um, so and after I started doing that I just kept that habit of eating fast food continuously and cooking food that wasn't healthy for me and the weight uh, crept up on me and it seemed like it happened so fast I lost, I gained like a hundred pounds just like out of nowhere um, and also I I have what they call polycystic ovarian syndrome which which you know messes with your weight too but I'll talk about that in another video um, so after after you know getting married, you know, having children, <laughs> the time for, and working full time, <laughs> the time for exercise was scarce, slim to none. Um, so being a wife working full time and a mother is overwhelming as it is. So I said to myself, there's just no way I can diet and exercise right now. And I guess I was putting myself, well, not I guess, I was putting myself on the back burner. I wasn't thinking of myself. I was putting my family first, but I wasn't putting myself first. And um, my mindset about diet and exercise was very negative, I guess. Um, I said to myself, you know, how am I going to find a time to do it? Um, then... Okay, then I saw a picture of myself on Facebook, okay, and that that picture woke me up. Someone took a picture of me standing up. I had a, uh, matter of fact, let me show you the picture of what I'm talking about right now. That was the picture that woke me up the pink shirt and jeans it I'm t it was atrocious I was looking just terrible I had to been about 275 pounds or whatever I know I just had a baby but still I was just too big and I'm 5'2 so that's way too big for my height um, and it's very unhealthy and I ended up with uh, you know a scare, uh, health scare my doctor told me if I don't you know lose weight I that I could get I could get diabetes so um, I was like oh no mm -mm. I don't want I don't want that 
So um, I told myself it's time to make a change. And also about that picture, um, I was looking at Plus Size Kamonica's channel, and she was telling it. She was telling everyone uh, about how that was that there was that one picture that woke her up. So uh, that one picture that I just showed you was the picture that woke me up. Um, so I tried losing weight on my own after I had my baby. Um, my goal was to lose about a hundred pounds so that I could be at my goal weight of about, uh, 165, 170. So, um, on my own, I went from like 275 to 268. Right at, when I got off of uh, maternity leave, I started walking again. So I was like, oh, okay, you know, I'm losing, I'm losing. Then I went from 268 to 257, and I stayed at 257 for the longest time. I'm like, oh my goodness, you know, I guess I'm not gonna lose any more weight. So, um, I was like, what am I gonna do, you know? So a family member of mine started Weight Watchers right around the time I had my baby. And um, a few months later, I saw that same family member shrink and shrink and they lost about 40 pounds and I was like wow if they can do it you know I want to try to do it too and I've tried all the diets I've tried Atkins vegetarian vegan um I wanted to try the all raw food so I started Weight Watchers January 17th 2012 at 157 pounds And uh, within the first week, I got to tell you, I lost four pounds the first week. And what I do is I do a combination of uh, Zumba classes a couple times a week. I walk every day to and from the bus, to and from work. Um, and I, I also have uh, Zumba on, on uh, Nintendo Wii, I, and I play that a couple times a week. And... Um, that's how I've been at plus plus Weight Watchers, and that's how I've been losing weight. So as of April 29th, which was yesterday, I am 225 pounds. And um, oh, I, you know I've customized my plan to my liking. Um, I'm pretty good with staying within my allowed points, and which I'll talk about that in another video. What I mean by that, I weigh myself actually every other Sunday. And I give myself a little, you know, cheat day, that which is also Sunday. So that's how I do it. I mean, I'm still losing. Even even with the cheat day once a week, I'm still losing weight. I've lost 32 pounds. So obviously, you know, it's not hindering anything. Um, I'm happy that I'm doing this because I'm not doing this just for my own personal benefit. But I'm doing this to benefit my family. I want to, you know run, jump, play, keep up with my son and be around for him as long as possible. And um, I thought I could never do it, but here I am doing it. Uh, I'm just getting started. And um, it's challenging, but hey, you know, life is full of challenges, right? You know, um, it's up to you how you deal with those challenges. You can either fight it or let it take over you. And I chose not to let my weight battles take over me. I want to take charge of it. So I hope I motivated someone out there to get healthy. Um, this is why I posted the video um, so that I can motivate others. And please find something that works for you. Weight Watchers may not work for you. So cause just keep you know looking for the program that works for you and don't give up. And I like. I'd like to thank um, other YouTube channels, Plus Size Kamonica, like I mentioned earlier, uh, Diva Slims Down, Beautiful Brown, Baby Doll, and um, Kaziah Myers. They've motivated me and encouraged me as well. And um, I'll keep you guys updated. And don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. I'm about to show you my, you know, weight progress pictures. Bef uh, how from January, well, from from baby weight to now, and then I'm going to show you the before and after pictures. So I'll see you guys later.